Hey everybody, so this is going to be a quick video about using Dynamo to pull out Clash coordinates from Navisworks. This workflow is more about pulling the data and storing it so that you can start to leverage it uh, for other things like better understanding how clashes happen, where they happen, uh, is there like a whole bunch of them that happen in specific spaces, and this is just one step of collecting that initial data to start doing that. So uh, this is kind of what the script looks like and uh or this is what it did look like so this was the script i built uh i think almost a year ago uh very very redundant you can see uh just the the copy of the the, the same same stuff over and over again and um by looking at this i figured i could do it a better way so this is the updated workspace there's not really much groups going on here but this isn't a very complicated script you open it you'll quickly know uh, what's going on so uh, the output of that uh, you could leverage uh, for something like this. So it's pulling out the coordinates. You could plot that information. You could start to analyze that information, start to understand it better. Uh, what what you know what common clashes happen in the uh, maybe in, in the uh, plenum space. What 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 typically happens in um, like the equipment rooms. You could start to better understand what exactly how how clashes happen in that 3D space. But I think what's more important is just having that data on hand. I think that's really, really valuable. And then you can start to answer these questions possibly. So um, the, the information, uh, the actual data that's, that's dumped out looks like, like this. It's a Excel file and we have a trade column, which is just the disciplines. So you can see arch there, if we scroll really far down, you can see structural, if we keep going, you can see electrical, plumbing was up there. Uh, and then in these other columns to the right, you can see uh, there's an X, Y, and Z, and these are the coordinates. And so a tool like Python and, and Plotly, you can read in those coordinates and quickly plot that information. Or you can kind of store a ton of this maybe in a SQL server and start to analyze that information collectively to see if there's any patterns that uh, may be happening within uh, that data. So that's all I wanted to show you, just to kind of um, show you that it is possible to pull that information out. Uh, that Dynamo script does use a couple packages, but you can grab that Dynamo script below in the in the description the OneDrive just find the folder with this the video name and you will find the script in there you can take it use it in any way that you want uh, let me know if there's anything cool that you you do with this and let me know if there's any um, uh, any anything that you need help with uh, if you have any troubles using this script uh, but that's it uh, for this video so if you want to like share comment do so and I'll see you in the next one